All right, folks, today we're making this amazing looking dish. I call it Dutch oven pound pot. So stay tuned. It's time to grill. Let's get today's video started with a starting chimney, half full of charcoal briquettes, heating up your cast iron pot. Today's dish is related to German's party recipes kitchen in the 80s. It's called pound pot, which is a word by word translation and which means that most of the ingredients have the same amount, exactly one pound. In Germany, one pound is about 500 grams. It's close to other countries and their system. I'm not 100% perfect with the measurements today, but all in all, that's the idea that stands behind this recipe. After starting with diced bacon, you will need onions, yellow onions. And in the meantime, we are making the sauce. You will need 500 grams of pasta sauce, 500 grams of apple puree, 500 grams of heavy cream and seasoning, salt and barbecue rub. We are using magic dust today, but feel free to use your favorite barbecue rub. Now give it a good mix and you have a first idea of consistency and color. Usually this dish is done with a board, store bought sauce, something like shashlik sauce. I decided to take a bottle of barbecue sauce today. I already like the color, really good. Set aside and check the onions and bacon mixture. Of course, there is more than one kind of meat inside this wonderful one pot dish. So add your diced beef. This is beef goulash. You can order this in German grocery stores. In the meat part, color is amazing. Give it a good mix. And we still have high heat here. We don't need more charcoal briquettes today. Later on, we're gonna switch this Dutch oven for braising time and the rest of the cooking time into the gas grill. Weather in Germany is still pretty cold, so that's the dishes I'm looking for. Not much work, not being outside too long. In the meantime, we have also diced some bell peppers, 500 grams of course, one pound of bell pepper, add them, and the colors are really good at this time. I like it. Of course, I've speeded this up a little bit for you. The cooking time for that dish on the charcoal grill is between 30 and 40 minutes. And then in addition, we have later on three hours of braising time. Give it a good mix. What I also haven't showed you beside the uh, chopping veggies idea is that I already made tiny meatballs out of ground beef. Ground beef is the next ingredient. We are using the third kind of meat in that meat, meaty one pot dish. And we're gonna add them now. And of course, one pound of ground beef. Just put them on top. We have seasoned them with salt and pepper. And of course, as always, we'll find the whole list of ingredients inside the video description. So you could check it out. You could even find the links to my fan pages. You could visit me on Facebook, Insta and TikTok. Then put in the sauce, mix a bit. The rest of the sauce can be set aside as well. You could add them while cooking. Just check the amount of liquids inside the Dutch oven in the meantime. 160 degrees Celsius is approximately 320 degrees Fahrenheit. And this is how the one pot looks like after three hours of braising. It seems not to look spectacular in the beginning, but as soon as you start stirring with the spoon, the goulash will fall apart and it will lead to a nice consistency. Add some fresh parsley and you're ready to serve these. Amazing dish. 
can't wait to hear your thoughts about that. Where are you located? Is that that kind of dishes you have been serving for 80s parties or uh, is this completely new to you? I would really appreciate your comments and your ideas about that. Can't wait to give it a try. Like the colors, like the smell, consistency is great. We have nice veggies in there. We have great meats in there. The meatballs are so delicious, I can tell you. And of course, as always, I'm going to give this a shot right now. Please make sure to hit that like button and leave me a comment. I would really appreciate if you could subscribe to my channel, of course, as well. We have some more videos coming up, so you won't miss any others of these. You could also visit my fan pages. I mentioned that. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm out. See you.